Hello. Hello. Greetings, foolish mortals. Tis I, cat. Good news! I have internet and I'm alive after the Hurricane Milton bullshit. Yay! <laughs> Although, last night was a nightmare for my sleeping. I decided to do some hardcore thrashing in my sleep. Didn't know I could do that. Oh. I had to apologize to so many plushies I threw off the bed. <laughs> you, uh, you okay over there? I, I, don't, I don't, I don't, I love how reactive your little guy is. I know it's because you're, you're using the Fugia stuff, but still. Um. I'm okay. I woke up with night sweats and shit. I don't even remember what I was dreaming. All I remember is my body went into da into I'm in danger mode. <laughs> I'm fine, by the way. I'm fine now. I drank my coffee. Ooh. And uh, oddly enough, before I watched stream, uh, a creator who creates cute little adorable things known as KP Creations on YouTube. I highly recommend her, by the way. Uh, she finally posted a video after... Uh, well, she doesn't post on a schedule she did that and got massive burnout so she's like i'm just gonna post when i feel like it which i feel that i feel that on a on a, on a spiritual level yeah S says the girl who posts every every fucking day mind you i do all that shit in advance and the art in question is anyway shut up um but i feel that on a spiritual level and she just recently lost one of her family dog and like she was planning to post and then the dog died but now she posted, and we're really happy, and we said her love, and she made cute little mushroom creatures, and they're adorable. Cora, remind me to send you the video later. Uh. If you like mushrooms. Do you like mushrooms? Yeah. Do you like fantasy mushroom creatures? I do like fantasy mushroom creatures. I love the myconids from D&D. Oh, they're cuter than the myconids from D&D. Hmm. Very cottagecore aesthetic adorable. One of them had, Two of them have a giant snail friend. And one has a little frog friend. Anyway, focus cat! Hey chat, uh suggestion. Should we get a cat shut up counter? <laughs> no! <laughs> Wait, is it does it have to activate every time I tell myself to shut up, or is it every time no, I tell no, myself? So it activates every time you say shut up to just like the nebulous void. <sighs> I mean, I know there's a way you can do it via streamer bot, which can activate with your eyes. By the way, Core, remind me to talk to you how to use streamer bot, which is a free program. All right. So in case you want to have some cool shit like I do. Okay, okay. What? Are you eating a banana right now? No, I'm eating a muffin. Was it a banana nut muffin? <laughs> no, it's an orange cranberry muffin. I do. That has eight grams of flaxseed in it. You're gonna be shitting. Oh hell yeah, I am. Especially with this yogurt that has that has ten grams of fiber in it. Cor, you're gonna be you're regular now. Okay, you I, I make fun of myself for eating like I don't wanna answer how many sticks of celery last night. But shut up. I'm very fibery. Anyway. So yeah. Also, Cor, tell them what you told me before the starting happened. Hold on, showing. Ugh. Why is Cor so adorable? Cor so adorable. I'm poking core. I'm poking core. Poke, 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 poke. Oh, wait, watch, watch the sword there. Okay, no, I'm not poking you with the sword. Not poking you with the sword. I'm promised. I'm, I'm not gonna poke you with the sword. Also, I think this is technically a knife. They there it... is a 3D. Hell, there is a 3D Barney's and Friends TV show that is out. So you want to know a weird fact I know about the first guy who was in the suit for Barney the Dinosaur? What? He runs a cult now. Cool. Is it around a purple dinosaur? No, it's a weird sex cult which also involves sexual massage. Okay. I'm very scared. I'm going to send you... I'm going to put in, in secret chat what this is, and you can choose whether or not to show everyone else. Hello. Walks. We're talking about our childhood. You know, there's actually. So, um, why is Barney? This, actually, really... this connect. This connects a lot, actually, to what we're doing right now. Barney, because we're we're talking about uh, we're gonna be play. You're gonna be playing uh, Epic Mickey, and that talks about like forgetting the nostalgia stuff. Meanwhile, we're living in this hell time where nostalgia is being used to is is being necrotized to bludgeon us over the head. Look at that thing. I don't wanna. Kind of look. 
Hey, Cor, also remind me to send you what I love, what, uh, North of the Borders video where he creates realistic Barney the Dinosaur as a T-Rex, basically destroying the crap out of BJ because he hated BJ. I'm like, what about Baby Bop? Didn't we hate Baby Bop? Was BJ yeah. more annoying or was Baby Bop more annoying in your opinion? I, I don't know. I hated all of Barney. Uh, yeah. Barney and Fred's. I, I just... Ugh. As to why I know this information, the internet. Um... Also, a pair yeah, secret text channel. Oh god, that thing is so fucking. I'm not showing that to chat. No. Do it. Make him look into the eyes of God. <laughs> that is not God. Okay. Apparently, everyone in the secret chat are now yelling at me to share this, so I'm going to share this. But then I'm immediately going to cast it out into the flames of Mount Doom. Hey chat, you want to see some nightmare fuel? You're about <laughs> to see some nightmare fuel. Barney Look is a dinosaur of thing. our imagination. Imagine seeing that in the middle of the night just peering around your door. Did Barney always have a gap tooth? I can't remember. I, I feel like he did. Like him. I'm not looking this up. I love myself. I'm not looking this up. Anyway. Barney is a dinosaur of our imagination. Let's see. Last, what, how, what Tell me we... the eyes of God. <laughs> oh. What is that? Which, what year was it? We did the whole, we were doing, uh, we were, I was doing Dead Space 2, and there was a whole talk about Peppa Pig, and Cor had a field day with that. Ah, Leo, Leo, ah, help, Iron Mouse has a gun. Who gave Iron Mouse uh -huh. a gun? You can't kill me. I'm the embodiment of... Of your imagination, which includes your nightmares. Listen, Barney. Listen, buddy. I am I am an entity of chaos. I am the embodiment of creation and chaos. Fuck you. I am creative chaos, not destructive chaos, contrary to popular belief. Anyway. Uh, isn't this kind of funny? We did Dead Space 2, talked about Peppa Pig. We're doing this. Talking about Barney the fucking dinosaur. Hey, hey, kids! We're we're in hell. This is hell. Hell, hell is not is. Also, I gotta stream the game of course so I can see it. So, uh, reportedly. Reportedly, always. This, and this, this is this is a this this is far this is a different uh this is a different tone by the way than Barney the fucking three D monstrosity over there. Oh, goody. Uh, you know Steve from Blue Scoos? Yes, he's a very sweet guy, and I know Ginger got to meet him. Yeah, evidently, uh, somebody, uh, showed him a... Uh, they were taking pictures, and somebody showed him, like, a picture of Bluey <laughs> mid-photo, and he took a picture with it making a face. Oh, he doesn't like Bluey. No, it was the, you're not my blue dog. Ah, uh. I like to think that Bluey and Blue would have been best friends. Also, they're both girls! Everyone always thinks Bluey and Blue are boys because they're, well, blue. Which that is called gender fi- that, that is called assigning gender to color, which we don't do here. And then, then when they discover, hey, you know Bluey's a girl, right? Oh, does that mean Magenta's a boy? No, Magenta Magenta's is also, also a girl! A girl. Also, I discovered it, Cor, because you're in the adorable mode, I have to make you bigger. My my sibling is calling out for Hopper. Should I be concerned? Please do not sacrifice Hopper to the Dark Lord! I, I, I'm gonna actually put Cor in front of the sword. It's called censoring. There. Ooh, new Transformer game. I hope it's good. I hope game good. Game not gonna be good. The transform. I, Although, mind you, uh, I fucking excuse you. I was about to say no. That's not true. Uh, was it the rise of Cybertron? I, there, there is a there. Fall is, of, uh, a, fall, a uh, war and fall of Cybertron were both fucking smashes. And uh, I'm not a platinum game person, but Transformers mm. Devastation was also really good. Okay, can you everyone's uh, court? Can you ch uh, check the stream to make sure audio and everything's good? Okay. Oh, my door's partially you, open. You, you, you have to talk. To you have to talk. Do the talk. Do the talk. Do the talk. What do you do think I'm fucking doing, Cor? Having the tea, tea with the queen? Can I close the door without leaving my chair? Okay. 
Funny enough, I am louder than you. Oh, fuck. Well, that's because I was away from my mic to close my door. Hello. It's me. I'm the problem. It's me. Plushy Godzilla, why are you sitting on top of my mic? You're supposed to be there. Okay. We are professionals. Yes, we are. We are professionals. We are. Core, are you a professional? Uh, a professional idiot. Anyway, Core, we're going to Tortuga. We're going to Pirates of the Caribbean. It's on Core's head. I would wear my pirate hat, but it clashes with the helmet. <laughs> the pyramid helmet is for my safety. <laughs> 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 Dead. Listen, Hurricane just brought up a bunch of pollen and gunk, so I'm gonna be like groggy for God knows how long. Oh yeah, also we got a hat. Oh. And we have the more golden gloves too, which means we're the nicer Mickey. Oh good, I'm glad to know we're go which ending we're going for. Wait, did you actually look up what you get the good at? What, what's the good Mickey? What's the bad Mickey for me? No, it's just uh, I remember that that deal uh, detail specifically. Mm. Is that if you look, if you're standing up upright more and you have like the golden gloves, that means you're going towards the more traditionally uh, nicer Mickey. Meanwhile, if you're in the more gremlin stance with with white gloves on, that means you're going towards the evil Mickey. You know we're gonna have to go through the evil Mickey, right? Well, yeah, you said you wanted Gremlin Mickey, and you I... want to see the horrible things you can do. Yeah, I just like, I want to go ape shit. Whee! Now, before anyone asks me what I'm doing, I'm just bouncing around checking for secrets. Secret door, secret door, secret door, secret door, secret door, secret door. Secret or door, why would... Secret... Why, why not secret door? Are you against secret doors? No. Also, apparently there is a haunted mansion level. Which I'm excited about, obvi for obvious reasons of obvi obviousness. But I have been told it's not that good. Oh no. And I sit here going, why is it not that good? So I'm wondering, this is the problem, because like, so many people tell me Yakuza 5 is a great Yakuza... No, wait, is it Yakuza 4? Yeah, Yakuza 4 is the best of the Yakuza games, right? I think Yakuza 4 is alright. I don't think it's the best, if that makes sense. Where hinges creak in doorless chambers. Where strange and frightening Oh, hello, Vincent Price in my ears. Where candlelights flicker, where the air is deathly still. Mm, yes. How dare you make that one creepiest fuck character in our Pathfinder game sound like Vincent fucking Price? Oh, it was so much fun. You can, you can hear in my rage. I channeled a little bit of Thief in the Cobbler. Okay, I've all, I've all the characters. Thief in the Cobbler is good. Okay, Thief in the Cobbler. If it actually got the chance to be what it was originally intended. What if? It would have smashed. It, it would have smashed. smashed really well. Also, sm these candles have been up on screen for a long time. They'll go away in a second. Jesus Christ. Core, core, core. The, the, the candles are for aesthetic. Aesthetic. I know, but I'm... But one's so fucking close to my face that I'm practically eating wax. But don't worry, the wax is edible. Yay? <laughs> <laughs> mm, what I love most in the world, waxy food. <laughs> I accidentally went into this building. I didn't mean to. Oh, popcorn! Popcorn! That popcorn looks so 2D. Which is fitting because you're in a we're in a 3D uh 3D game about 2D characters. Look at my elite skills, kids! Look at it! I'm elite! I'm elite gamer! Dear God, you learned how to use the double jump. Hey, listen. Weird thing is, I don't know why, but my natural instinct when it comes to video games is to see if there's a double jump. Hey chat, place your bets on how long it's gonna take these candles to disappear. Are they still up? 
Yeah, they're still up. That's why I was complaining about them. Hold on. <laughs> wow, you are literally in front. Of okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes, I am. Hold on, let me check the candle. Let me check the thingy for my thingy. Give me a second. Give me a second. We're do we're doing some math right now. Ow! I've been hit in the head. Okay, which one is this one? Haunted Mansion. Hey, cat. It's supposed to be 21 seconds. But last time I checked, <laughs> 21,000 to... I, I fucked up. I fucked up! I blew it up. I blew it up! Oh no, someone's trick-or-treating. Oh good, you're another trick-or-treater. Let's you, see what you get. You or fucking pulled a NASA! Your Lord. What? You pulled a NASA. <laughs> I added one too many zero. Listen, milliseconds is stupid to me. I don't know why we can't just do everything in seconds. <laughs> they programmed the landing from feet to meters. Instead of landing, oh, good, the fucker the buried. Cheater. Let's see what you get. A keyblade. You now have the key to the hearts. Suffer. I've Enjoy learned how to make my freaking plant have funny audio, funny he who audio effects now. <laughs> oh, everyone's returning trick or treat. Let's get this out of our systems oh, good, now. Another trick or treater. Let's see what you get. A skeletal left foot. Enjoy your reward. Why do I have a collection of skeletal left feet? Is my question. Ah, Mickey Mouse in Jungle Rhythm. Okay, before we can go in. Mm, jungle Rhythm, you say? Please, oh, God. Oh, another trick or treater. Let's see what you get. Fun-sized candy bars that aren't actually fun-sized. Enjoy your reward. Okay, excuse me. Okay, please, oh, merciful God, in art, please have nothing racist. Thank you. <laughs> please, please, may Jungle Rhythm not have anything racist. Please let the lips be normal sized. Please let the lips be normal sized. Please, oh God, please, please, oh merciful. Get Mickey, get up. I will fight nature. Hey it? yo, what they doing behind that behind that tree? Oh look! Oh well, okay. Good news. No racist caricature. Bad news. Nightmare fuel monkey. Okay, at least it's actual monkeys. At least they are. At least they are legit, like chimpanzees and stuff, and not whatever fucking Disney did back in the 1940s. Oh god, I can't remember what Disney did in the 1940s. Well, let's go. That's... Hey, cat, that that log that you were trying to climb over was hollow. Listen, I know what I'm doing. I am elite gamer now. Look at me, elite gaming. Let's go to racist Disney caricatures. Let's not and say we did. Oh, but we're exploring the horrors of Disney. We're exploring. We're going to see all the horrors of Disney. <sighs> Bad caricatures of all people. Yeah. Except for white people. Ooh. Or. Ooh. Cor, the sounds you are making are not very confirming. Com uh, comforting. Hmm, Fantasia continued. Holy shit. Oh god, I forgot about fucking Fantasia! I don't even think the VHS version of the Fantasia movie I have had that caricature in it. Yeah, My mother if you're has wondering what I'm talking demon. about, the, uh, the, the, the centaurs. Oh, the, oh boy. Oh my god, they got in the comics! There's a comic? Yeah. Oh boy! 
It's the one I was afraid of. Ooh. Four. My mother is summoning a demon. She is sneezing so loudly. Ah, things are floating. And then there's one where I'm just like, I just, wait. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. Nope. Yep, nope. I was that's, about uh, to that's say. That's still some racism. The, uh, that, that, I was about that's... to say. The crows in uh, Dumbo. No, I saw one where, where it was like, oh, they're wearing a, like a top hat thing. They're they're on the ground. They look like boozed out. Oh, it's an Irish caricature. And then I looked at it a little bit more like, no, that that's still African-American. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's still it's still African-based uh, racist caricature. Yeah, the Codex, the crows are kind of racist, though. Oh, look. Pirates! Yeah, they, they are cool characters. We can acknowledge that they are cool and also very, very <laughs> not in good taste. Yeah, they're very, they're more interesting than some of the characters in Disney, in the, it, in, in Dumbo. It's like how we can, it's like how we can appreciate like the, uh, the Indian characters in Peter Pan while also going. Hey, speaking of Peter Pan! <laughs> speaking of Peter Pan. Okay, fun fact! The Smee here is not the right colors as the Smee from the TV, the, from the movie. Remember, Smee in the movie had a red hat with blue striped shirt. This was based off of his concept art. Oh, cool. I only learned that because I was kind of doing research to figure out how far I was in the game. <laughs> well, only handman, I guess. Why are we in Tortuga? This feels weird having freaking Smee in Tortuga. Why is why is Captain Hook a fucking um a pirate? Uh, not a pirate, a um, robot. Ah, got it. What? So you remember the mad scientist in the so, very beginning of the movie? He made a machine that basically turns the tunes into into robot monsters, so they can do his evil doing. <sighs> Huh. Lazy and dim-witted? I was gonna say unfocused. I feel that's me. Yeah, Captain Hook ain't forgotten. He's so loved. How many drag performers do Captain Hook? Someone call the drag kings. How many of y'all do Captain Hook? You know, the machine hook cleared us out of Tortuga. You stop him and first have to go through and need to fix the door opening contraption. You broke- You broke shit! Sam and Damon Saad is a big old one who's love struck. He's got the figurehead. And Scurvy Pete is a sneaky eyed fella with that the compass. Uh huh. If you capture these items, bring them to me. That's why I can repair the control. Get on the items, pass through the thing. Gotcha. I'm not being a dick. I am a platforming genius. I am a god. I. What is this? Is supposed to be Robinson Tree? I am a god of creation and destruction. You will bow before my presence. This is like a reference to the Swiss Family Robinson Tree House. Oh, might be actually. It might actually be. Ah oh, yes, tiki masks. Mm. Oh boy. We got, we got a little bit of it here, guys. Just a scunch, just a scunch. Just the tiniest bit. Tiny bit of racism. As a, tr I was about to say as a treat. I can't even do that. As a, as a treat. As a, tr as a very horrible treat. Mm. For us streamers in our content creation, just a tiny bit of racism for us to react to as a treat. Oh yes, to show how we're not racist by reacting to the racism. Shows how we should not be cancelled, etc, etc, etc. Right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm streaming, hello. Oh! Oh, look, my drugs! <laughs> oh. 
Mom has a migraine. Hello, cat's mom. Of course, whispering hello, cat's mom. I'm not racist. I'm culturally spicy. Come on, come on. Ah, elite gaming. Look at me. I'm elite gamer. Look how elite I am. Acknowledge my eliteness core. I, that walks. That feels like something that belongs. <laughs> I feel like PewDiePie has said that at least once. Pe PewDiePie references are still in, right? Yes, yes, PewDiePie's still... PewDiePie's still still good. He he has apologized. Oh, he's finally apologized? Now has Logan Paul apologized for his bullshit? Oh, Logan's never gonna apologize. He's a piece of shit. Oh, yeah, yeah. Watch Logan Paul be like, We're gonna watch some random VTubers who talk about me. Logan Paul's a piece of shit. What's this weird little freaking chaos entity? Chaos entity? She just looks like a sad person in a hoodie. Hey, Logan, fuck you. From us to you, fuck off. Take a, take a nice big bad dragon dildo and just have fun. He doesn't deserve the goodness of <laughs> <laughs> This stream sponsored you by- This stream not sponsored by them, obviously of obvious- Ah! Hot, 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 spicy. The water's spicy. Why is the water spicy? Oh, Logan did apologize, but then went right back. So he really didn't apologize. He just went- he just took the BP oil method and went, I'm sorry. We'll do we better. We're sorry. He we'll did do the, better. He did the shitty ex term in general, not my actual shitty ex method of apologizing, then going right back to his shit. Again, shitty ex in general, not my, not, 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 not Pacific in this case, for. Put the whiteboard down. You know, at least, well, you mentioned it, now the, doesn't count. My elite gaming skills up out here, up on here. I am elite gamer. Elite gamer who can't... My true nemesis, the camera. Oh yeah! He's too busy looking for scams to get the dumbasses. You mean children? Because remember Don't in the Walt Disney Bath slushy of paint remover aka T H E dip. Not the dip. Anything but the dip. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing! Ow! Hey, Cat, aren't you gonna do the freaking plot? No. Ooh, secret door. Secret door to nothing! You are useless, secret door! I shame you. Ace, we cannot have the door open, or else... Or else we'll, we'll ruin Cat's stream with echoes. Aww. I want the door open because it feels like you guys are fighting. You're like, no, we're not fighting. We just don't Shame. want an echo Shame. to happen, my dude. Oh, yeah. Elite gaming right there, baby. This is oh, yeah. Elite oh, yeah. Elite gaming. Are, are you Kronk now? <laughs> no, I can never beat... I can never be Krunk. There is only one Krunk. Okay. What a vaguely tree shaped thing. Oh, no. Tree shaped now tree. Daisy? Tree shaped now shaking tree. Oh, yeah, let's go. Oh, oh. oh my god! <laughs> Wait, did you know that we're playing a third Epic Mickey game and it was going to also have co-op? Like, three or four person co-op? And I'm annoyed that didn't become a thing? 
Just imagine me and Core playing Epic Vicky 2 and 3, co oping together! Yeah. Oh, Daisy, I knew him well, Oswald. Her well. Her well. Fuck. That would have been really clever. Fuck. Damn it. Okay, so where are her body parts? Dude, that's what I ask myself every day when I'm looking for my boobs. Mad Doctor, dissimilar I'm attractors are scattered all over the pirate's wasteland. So I have to look for them? <laughs> Those bitches hide around the apartment. <laughs> Do they have legs? I don't know. I don't know how how tits just get up and walk away, but but girl, those ones just seem to seem really good at hiding. Who interrupted Hellsman and Antonio's meditation? Uh, did you see me levitating just now? I'm learning to expand my cartoon abilities. Oh, at least he acknowledges what he is. Cartoon? Yeah. He looked at his he looked at his like long as fuck torso and short legs went, This is not anatomically correct. <sighs> you give me my shit. I'm missing a treasure of a personal sort, and I believe it's in that tree house. I got no legs for climbing fetches down the compass. I'm told this key will unlock the place. All right. The Back. hunts for tits be real. Especially the bird. Ah! Ah, we we have a survivor asking for entrance. You may enter, survivor, if you speak the password, which is friend. Oh crap! I told everyone the password now. Fuck! Yeah, but you didn't say in what what language. That is true. Anyways, yeah, Prince. Yeah, Prince, I can't really... If I don't have my tits, I can't really do this authentically. Fuck, that didn't catch on, on Discord, did it? No, it did not catch. The thunk did not catch on Discord. I know exactly what you were doing. It's almost like we're friends. I couldn't be able to do this authentically. <laughs> okay, wait. What, what am I supposed to do with this stupid thing? Uh... Search Ventureland to find the treasure. Scurvy pirate seeds to pay him and eat tickets. Okay. Right, right, right. We gotta find the thingy. Okay. Find the thingy. Whee! Ow! I think I, think I do need to message. Message fire in, in Discord. Mm. Damien Sod, who you seem like a worthy sword. I don't suppose you know what woman might want. What a woman wants? Um, respect one of them. Welcome to Astaria, gentlemen. We want Astaria! <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Astaria. I don't suppose you know what the woman wants. Well, not to be sold. That's for certain. Not to be sold. Not to be the R word. I suppose I'm you know. Gonna speak the, I'm gonna speak the friend word, the path word. Damn, I messed up my own joke. I'm gonna, I'm gonna come in and say, Unali. This is my new Cherokee word for the day. Ah! Aww! Aww. Today. Unali. Unali. <laughs> <laughs> Two white people oh. really trying to say the word. It sounds hilarious. To be fair, I'm no, but I'm not much better. Okay. Even if it is my heritage. Uh, well, to anyway, be yeah. fair, Fire, something happened to your heritage that made it really hard to get culturally linked again. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And as a white person. I am very resp I feel very responsible for that. Also, as a white person, I feel okay. very responsible for that, even though... You get a pass. Okay, good. It's like how I cannot connect to my Irish roots. Or my Scottish roots. <laughs> Yay, that instantly wipes away my white guilt. If only it was that fucking easy. God, no. Ne guys, never forget history. Please, for love of God, never forget history. If there's one man, if there's one man that doesn't know what women want, it's Belster Guild. I don't get that one. Okay, anyway, flowers are hard to get here in the wasteland, but ice cream? That would be easy. I have ice cream. Wait, Balthazar. Uh, but I can't. Oh, I see. It's because the it's because the intro bit. So welcome to Estalia, gentlemen. That's Balthazar Guild. Uh. Welcome oh, people to, oh, oh. Okay. to to Spanish Vietnam. 
court. Okay, we have to talk. We have to talk to a woman to figure out what she wants for a gift. Hey, look, a woman. Hi. No, you just asked for. Yes, this is fire, by the way. But yes, uh, Wigs 2001. I I get what you're saying. But yes, uh, what does a woman want? Is it pants with pockets? Yes, please. I heard that's always yes. a hit. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. I do love when we both win. Yes, pockets, please. Shop is closed. I'm just I'm, uh, boring to say at least. Just what's the other's about the business? That one's Serby Pat. He's been eyeing the treehouse all day. He's been waiting up there since that bloke Antonio took talked to him yesterday. And I said the one to report up, but uh, I've learned my mind, my own business, such man since losing my eye. Oh, who stole your eye? It wasn't mud. It wasn't. Me wife, uh, me ex wife. We went into a divorce, and she just and she took the other eye with her. I was gonna say it was PT the. The PD, the flying, the flying jackass. <laughs> PD, the flying. Oh, Peter Pan. Yeah, that, that's the one. <laughs> I like PD, the flying jackass. So let's be perfectly honest. Peter Pan, he is a jackass. He's you're... Faye. Of course, he's a jackass. He's not even. Yeah, yeah. Here's the thing. You know, you've grown up when you're just like, you know, Peter Pan was kind of a jackass. Wait, why do you all yeah. call me Hook? My name is my name is James. Why why would you associate my name with such a horrific part of my life? Who, who would have done that? Me to the flying jackass. <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> hey, am I stupid? Yes, I am. What about, what about this man? This this gorilloid over here, the, this this monstrous looking human being. What do you think his name is? Bilbert? My, na my name is Steve. Oh. Steve, his name is Steve. Me, me parents are Greek. His parents was Greek. <laughs> I feel like you're doing a bit now, and I don't know what it's from. If Ginger pops in, then they then they can tell you it's from a TikTok. Also, guys, look, I'm king of the world. You are one slip away from becoming Mufasa. <laughs> Long oh, live the king. Oh. Mickey's a cartoon. He'll he'll be fine. Hey, perfectly fine. He'll be fine. Oh. <laughs> Hi. Just pancakes all over the ground. In the tiki 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 room. In the tiki 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 room. Da 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 da. In the tiki 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 room. My mom loves the tiki, the enchanted tiki room. I was gonna say, cartoons don't die; they just fade away, fade away. Get back here, fire! No, okay. Okay, here I got the free tiki mask. Why did you get the three what? tiki masks before getting the quest? Because I saw shiny shit and I'm part magpie. You really can yeah, hold let, your let own. Let me change over to stuff. Fugi, Fugi, let me be shocked. Let me be shocked. Fugi. Fugi, not, don't comply. Fugi, you little yeah. punk ass bitch. Let me be shocked. Toons don't die. Are you, are you sure about that? I really hope so because, you know, my mom was a toon. Well, that explains so much. Yeah. <laughs> like no. her, like her phobia of confrontation. Mm. Okay. That, that, that allowed so much fun things to happen. Uh, so a fun fact: when I used to have my face on stream for like uh the uh, uh y'all remember that I did the uh the uh entertainment news uh podcast thingy, which had my face yes. involved. People would jokingly say I'm very an very overly animated, like a cartoon. I go, yeah, that makes sense. My mom pointed a cartoon. That's why I'm so animated. Mm -hmm. Remember the original plot, The Cool World? Yeah, that was my fam. That was based on my life. <laughs> ah. I was going to say, you're also on technically on the East Coast, so I know a lot of people on the East Coast tend to animate with their hands. I'm Italian! Of course I animate with my hands! If I don't animate with my hands, I'm dead! Hey... Hey y'all, you want to know a really fun thing? Our influence that I grows. found out Ooh. through Ginger. Mm -hmm. So they animate with their hands a lot. They're from the East Coast. It, it, no, it, it turns out a <laughs> one thing. I I think it might be a stim, but one one thing that autistic people do a lot is talk with their hands. So do a lot of Italians. 
Anyway, as I was saying. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> yeah, hold on. Artemis VT, uh, Armis VT, thank you for becoming a foolish mortal. We will get your crypt ready soon. May your blanket will be any color or pattern on as long as it's cotton or cotton. Thank you for accepting more chaos into your life. May I ask where you found little old me? Oh, Prince knows what I'm talking about. Prince knows the quote. You see that guy over there? Over, over there? The absolute freak of nature? You know what I call him? Josh! Cause that's his name! Also, you said that core, I just kept my brain went to it. Are they are they autistic or European? Are they autistic or European? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yes! Anyway. Anyway. Not racist. <laughs> Please don't cancel us, Twitch. Um, I have no fear. The party has arrived. Ginger's here. Ah, hi, Ginger. And ah, oh, Armus, you found Armus, you found this on a uh, on the recommended on the page. Task. Nice, nice. Black and red work for also, me. Also, I have to ask the obvious question. Yes, Armus, is your username is it based off of Armus from Star Trek or just something else entirely different? Because my brain's wired to that. Fire, your Trekkie is showing. No. <laughs> I can. You can't make me. I'll do Fun it myself. Fact, apparently Trekkies were wanting to call themselves Trekkers, but for some reason that didn't stick. Yeah, I remember I remember those days, because the Trekkies were the ones who grew with um, the original series. Yeah. Trekkers was basically every every generation, next generation thereafter. But did Trekkers, not dude. Trekkers just sounds like you know you're a trucker, but you forgot how to spell trucker. No offense. You're a tr oh, but yeah, it sounds like a trucker who watches sci-fi <laughs> while I have on arrived. the road. Speaking of truckers Don't who watch sci-fi. Hi, Ginger. Hi, Ginger. <laughs> I guess I'm a trucker now. I have arrived. And also, yes, that's what my dad used to call himself. A trucker uh, or a trucker? A trucker. Because uh. he, cause he was, he would correct you. He would be like, we're not trekkies, we're trekkers. Because he's from old school Star Trek. He's he knows Klingon. What about One-Eyed Pete? That's on his birth certificate. That's his legal name. Me parents was Greek. His parents. His parents was Greek. Was Greek. <laughs> I love that. Spit. Where's Henrietta? Uh, uh, the lady at the wait. fountain. Oh fudge! I gotta go all the way back to the fountain. What fountain? behind you. Oh. oh, I was confused. Core probably knows why I was confused, but I was very confused. Mm, trees, plants, Never I mind. wish there were more flowers. The scent of flower bouquet would cover the pirate smell air. I also enjoy being being away from that ice cream parlor. All well, the guys keep bringing me ice cream, trying to win my heart. I'll tell you a secret. I'm actually lactose intolerant. <gasps> and she's a cow. So she wants flowers. Tell him she wants flowers. You're the wrong pirate. Sorry. Hey, Armis. Uh, speaking of some uh, Mage the Awakening, have you uh, have you been uh, paying attention to any wizard games as of late? Huh? Uh, I gotta go back to Clarabelle. If anyone needs me, I'm going back to Clarabelle. Uh, it depends on the time, Claire. Please clarify. Yeah, oh, uh, like okay, which oh, wizard? A, uh, a particular podcast made by the crew behind Emperor had a text to speech device. Oh, it's a podcast called Wizard Games. Uh, it's, it's a, uh, live play of Mage the Awakening oh. by the people gotcha. who, God, these monkeys look terrifying. <laughs> focus, these core, things focus. are going to haunt my nightmares. Uh, it's your new sleep paralysis, Stephen. But yeah, it's a, it's a, uh, new live play led by Speaker D, the voice of the Emperor. Nerds. As well as, uh, Big D! 
Nerds. All of you. All of you are nerds. None of you are You are sleep. dressed as Pyramid Head. I do not want to hear <laughs> goddamn shit from you. I'm, I'm not a nerd at all. I don't know what you're talking about. Shut uh, it, Shepard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Cor, you're the only I'm, one not in costume. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite stream on Twitch. Thank you, Commander <laughs> Shepard, for selling you. <laughs> Thank you for Commander. Thank you, Commander Shepherd, for whoring yourself out on every fucking store in the Citadel. <laughs> now give me my discount. Give me my goddamn discount. Uh, hey. Is Probate in it? Uh, no, he is not. Uh, Probate uh, is not in Wizard Game yet. <laughs> it has like the usual crew of Arendelle, um, Hulky Crow. Uh, one new face, and uh, the the lady from the Rot Grind campaign. Don't mind Kat, she's going to go get flowers. I don't know why I'm we can't just pick a bunch of random flowers from the jungle! I'm not a nerd, I'm a geek. Well, joke's on you, because I'm a nerd, a geek, a dork, and a dweeb. Wow. So when do you get your license to the, kill? The dweeb part is a, is a little bit more heavier. <sighs> I already have my license to kill in Mass Effect. <laughs> I have my license to kill a bunch of freaking chicken wings. Mm hmm chicken wings. God, I'm craving Go, some decent chicken Go wings. Don't you, sir. I have have a photon favor. Oh. God, no. Um, so, wa wax, I'm going to assume is how you say that. Yep. It's in uh, Mass Effect 2, so if you're still in 1, you haven't seen it yet. You basically can inquire about like hey can i get a do you want a a promotion uh, from me yeah a promotion or something or like an endorsement and if you do you just record the same <laughs> shepherd just records the same i'm commander shepherd and this is my favorite store on the citadel for like each store and so <laughs> yeah, yeah but you don't even have to swear loyalty to one store you can do it to every store to get a discount there's nothing illegal about that right right no <laughs> It's just, uh, listen, it just looks this, really shady as fuck. No, I was like, listen, this is my favorite store to buy it's guns. This is my favorite time, store to buy armor. Butter, and this is time, peanut butter jelly butter time. Butter time. I'm sorry, what? Peanut butter jelly time. Wait, hold on. A what favor, Prince? When did we say that? I mean, I'll jump on that sort of favor, but. <laughs> Stop jumping on things. Uh, you're not thinking big enough. You need a bouquet of flowers. Of course, I could just pick up. Okay, you can find flowers around Oztown and Mean Street. You can make them a bouquet from those. I have to uh, make a really? fucking bouquet! Calm emotions. Calm emotions. What the fuck? Y'all seeing this? Seeing what? Glitch. Seeing what? What is it? What? Am, it oh! To be a glitch. Oh no! I have to go find flowers. Goofy Tron, are you doing okay there? That's my dick. I nearly fucking choked on my yogurt. <laughs> you, you fucking ass! I nearly, I nearly died on yogurt. <laughs> yogurt death, the greatest of them all. Unfortunately, though, with the with the, like discount from Mass Effect, you can't be like, "I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite whorehouse on Omega." I want to say I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite whorehouse on Omega. In Omega. Oh, thank you, Prince. Thank you for clarifying. You're welcome. Photon phaser sounded like futon uh, fuda flavor. I'm like, what? what? I'm sorry, what? What would no favor favor like saying pork favor where the hell are the god dang flowers i need plant life where the hell are these motherfucking flowers in this motherfucking field there are tons of flowers none of them pickable <laughs> i wonder if you can erase them and they'll pop out poor that's horrible to try do it. It didn't no work. <laughs> you didn't try all the flowers. Okay, think. Let's use our brain cell. Wait, could it be... Try try to erase that tree that has the one rose on it. 
Oh, or there. Or it's that flower. They're hidden. Oh, oh. cool. It's a then fetch... you go in front of this house to your It's right. an annoying Here's... fetch quest. Go to the front of this house that you were behind. Okay. So go there's like a bush. Put your your erasy juice on that one bush right there. Put your Is dick on the juice. Oh, maybe you're not. It had Wait, one is flower that on flower it that like that. Is that bush an udder? No, it's a cat. <laughs> oh. With a okay. little hat. J Core? What? Grabs your face. Don't fucking at me because the the goddamn bush looked ambiguous. <laughs> Don't fucking at you. They're in the shapes of her victims, as we already have established that Clarabelle definitely has bodies of people she's murdered buried in her garden. Oh, for the love of God, why are you uh, turning this already dark game even darker? She already has a hidden murder basement! You have a hidden murder basement! I wish. What the fuck is going on? Um... <laughs> Hi, Cor. What is wrong with you people? Well, I'm from Don't Florida. I think I knew you're married to one of these people. I know. <laughs> and like... I'm sorry, you want to be in her murder basement. No, she wants... No, Ginger wants to own a murder basement. Oh, cool, that's great. That's you know, less horrifying. As, as the woman married to you, I love that. You don't want to own a murder... Ow. I need it for my projects. I need a murder basement so I can cool. have a place I'm to- Cool, I'm never being a part of your projects. But Cora, <laughs> we were planning to start making jams and jellies in the basement. Best place I'm to store- I'm sure, I'm sure, what? And, and preserves and all that shit. Best place to store them is in the basement. At least what kind of serial killer ass bullshit is going on right now? <laughs> would you rather us start a- Would you rather us start a freaking, uh, a, a barber shop? Cause, I mean, we could start a barber shop. Wait, wait. Is that is that coat rack? Isn't there like a wooden character that that coat rack is? I guess is it that coat rack the wooden character? I don't. Or is it just I don't know. shaped like the wooden character? Ginger, I'm going to answer mm. with you honestly and bluntly. I don't fucking know. <laughs> Calm down there, cat. No need for your fucking fancy. Fuck <laughs> you! <laughs> uh, ah! Why is there a the sheer? with this language. Where? Why is there a bench beside a sheer cliff? I don't know. Look around at the world. Why is this entire town just floating in nothingness? It's because it was forgotten by the Mickey. The Dark Lord Mickey Mouse. I mean, technically the Dark Lord Disney, but Walt Disney, if you think about it. Yeah. Oswat holding hands with God. Or at least could make a, two, uh, two, <laughs> two hand prints, two footprints in the. Uh, no, not that stupid poem. Yes, I could. I could do that totally for Walt Disney. I just, I just read this in the chat. I, quote: "I'm from Florida." Enough said. You're unfixed. Damn. 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 <laughs> Damn, deep cut, deep cut. Hey, listen, I have no problems Damn. admitting there's some problems with the state. It. I don't feel like the government represents me, but that's just my own personal hum humble it's opinion. Okay. It's okay, it's okay, uh, Kat. I know exactly how you feel when it comes to people crap- Like, we're allowed to insult our states. Oh, yeah! You know how crappy it is. Yeah, no, no, Don't no. You know? <laughs> It's like your family. I'm the only one who's allowed to insult my family. Once you insult my family, even if I have issues with my meth head cousin, you don't fucking mess with my meth head cousin. Exactly. Though sometimes I think that certain meth head cousins deserve it, but you get but you get the point. I can insult my family. Y'all are unless you got my permission, y'all ain't allowed to. Yeah. Yeah, it's uh so yeah, cats from Florida. I'm the pumpkin king over here is from New Jersey, and we will absolutely tear our state up. A whole new one because it deserves it, but now shiny. And yeah, <laughs> I made my point. Yeah, same thing with Texas, though. Uh, I will say most people externally that try to tear apart Texas 
just don't understand. There is lots yeah. to criticize, but you gotta know who you need to criticize. Yeah, I don't criticize yeah. Austonians. Austin people from Austin are fine. Sometimes. <laughs> Depends. But Oh yeah, people sometimes from Austin. Sometimes they can be a little elite. But... A little elitist, yeah. It's like people from Orlando think they're better than me. It's like ten percent are elitist, the other ninety are high as fuck. Yeah, lots it's, of hippies. It's the same way we feel about New Yorkers. And I don't mean New York the state. New York the state is fine because they usually don't cause as much problems. It's the city. <laughs> oh, yeah. Fuck you, New uh -huh. Yorkers. Learn how to fucking drive. Anyway. Anyway. They don't need to drive. Off, yeah. they, have, they just walk like five feet to get to the grocery store. Lucky them. I didn't mean to tell one of my New York friends. Uh, how, how, do you, how does anybody get anywhere? You're always going, I'm walking here. And you never... <laughs> But you're never actually walking. You're always screaming at each other. It's an entire city of people screaming, I'm walking here. I'm walking here. <laughs> I 100% love that that was just like completely improv because some idiot drove past the barrier and he didn't. And literally, Dustin Hoffman just actually almost got run over. <laughs> Stayed in character the entire time, slapping the dude's car hood. I'm walking in. I do love that though. That that was pure New Yorker. I don't even know if that man's yeah. from New York, but boy, how did he channel the city in that one particular moment? I know there's like a scene in a, a CSI Las Vegas, and they find a handprint on this guy on this victim's car, and they're like, oh, and they find it, and they're like, why is your handprint on this car? She goes, I'm from. York. He tried to run me over. I smacked the hood like a proper New Yorker. <laughs> I'm like, Accurate. cheers to that. My favorite example is from Becker, where he just like, where he goes, he goes in for uh, to renew his driver's license, and and it's like, and actually, you you failed. The, the, who who has the right of way? I'm from New York. The person who has the right of way is the guy with the gun. <laughs> okay, I'll give you that. <laughs> <sighs> I love what we're talking about this shit while I'm trying to figure out where they stand flat. Okay, I need three flowers. We must think like a plant. What the fuck is this? What? Just got an ad for something. What the hell am I looking at? If it, if it has a lady with a foot for a head, it's, a, it's Snapchat. No, it's like it's some cartoon by the looks of it. Or are Wait, you, are you watching this... the stream instead of watching the stream? It sounds like Core got a, got a commercial while watching the stream. You know, the stream, which is streaming on Discord. Are you streaming it live? On there we go. You <laughs> never said you were! I even got here before before you were doing that. <laughs> Fool. Are you fucking idiot? You're, you're watching the stream and not watching the <laughs> Discord stream? You fucking fool. <laughs> Meanwhile, my ass has not even been told the thing is up. Thing. I said, I, I muttered, and I quote, gotta get this set up for Core to watch live. Oh, cool, because I'm listening to every fucking mutter you have. Core's like, I respect you. I don't listen to your mutterings. I have ADHD. This is a fucking hate crime. You can't say it's or a admit. hate crime. Yes, it, yes, I can. I absolutely can if it's a... Oh boy. You guys just like, oh, you weren't paying attention mind. to me? No, okay, I wasn't Louis. because I was listening. Oh, I was mind. trying to make sure I was a good mod on your stream. Or has ADHD. They barely listen to non mutterings. They barely listen. Uh, all right, listen here, you little ginger freak. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Court, I'm going to teach you the wisdom of, of, of our people. We're, we're and millennials. Um, we're so poor, we can barely, we don't even have enough money to pay attention. <laughs> I'm not even poor. I don't even have enough money for the extra R. For the R. <laughs> yes. The ADHD base is uh, a. Where, where do you think the deficit comes from? The attention deficit disorder. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's my bank account. <laughs> okay. Can someone please give me a brain cell and tell me where the hell is the damn flowers? Where's the blacksmith? Where's the blacksmith? All right, let's see here. Epic Mickey. One flower flowers. is under Clarabelle's lawn. Fuck you! Oh, it's under Clarabelle's. Out. Oh, it's it's in her murder basement. Okay, okay. You do have to go in her murder basement. Okay, where's? Uh, so we didn't need to go back there because 
because of the fact we already went under there for the power thing. God damn it, we're, it, we're it retreading places. and jump down to find the flower. Okay, where's the, is there one here in Mean Street? Look if there's one in Mean Street while I'm still here. Uh, you found the one behind her house. Third is found left of the gag factory, along the wall in a hidden cave. Then Where, the where's the gag factory? Down your throat and to the left. A, where's a factory? I, yeah, where is a factory? What is a factory? Who is a factory? <laughs> Why is a factory? We can do this all day, people! Uh, it's in Oztown. Is it's it the one with the safe. Oh, 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 that's, that's, uh, okay. Oh, it's that one! Oh, I see now. Oh, very then nice. Then all the who's down who's still, the, the, the small and the bald. Tall and the small. Small and the bald. I didn't know bald was a height. Yeah, you lose inches once you start balding. <laughs> hey, the, alliter the alliteration works. <laughs> Why mean, do you think I want to get on HRT? I want to keep my height. No, become small like the rest of us. No, I want. I like my hair. One of the small. One. You, you are. Small. You are where baldness does pass down from the mom's genes, right? That's. It's, it's called male pattern baldness. Hmm. When is the factory? Why is the factory? How is the factory? No one asked how the factory is doing. We're breaking OSHA violations! The o oh no, it's the OSHA death squads! You know you <laughs> The are... newest factor in Forever Winter, the OSHA death squads. No, don't give them ideas. You've come for your forklift certifications! <laughs> you, know, you know the source, congratulations for <laughs> systematic design. That's the, oh that's, the, that, that's the hard mode in Frostpunk. You gotta make sure everything's OSHA. Something about that just reminds... I think it's the OSHA talk. Just reminds me of... I used to work for this... Um, this guy who was... He was the technical director for a, a music performance hall. And he was an old school roadie, but also an old school tech director. And he, would, he told me this story about this guy uh, who was just terrible at doing things that osha would cry at like he this guy would get up in the genie which for cat you definitely probably know what i mean mm -hmm. and i know core you know but for anyone who doesn't genie it's this machine it's, it's similar to a cherry picker you like raise up in it and it goes up high and you can change the lights yeah um, it's good if you if, if you don't have a if you have a dead hung theater which is the the where the lights, the bar the lights hung on do doesn't move up and down. It's a, a one thing that you can use it for. Uh, and this guy would go up in the genie and he would, to move, instead of using the genie controls or actually, no, it was the kind where you had to go all the way down and then push it. It didn't have, it wasn't motorized to move while you were up. And instead of going all the way down and pushing it to move it, he would grab onto the battens and Pull himself across. Do you see me flinching? <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, kind of like this is her lift. Genie. I don't know if there are other brands, but Genie's like the most prevalent brand. Why does ha why does this cow have a murder basement? <laughs> because. <laughs> She's got the place where she has to deal with the bodies. They overflowed from her garden. I hate how you have answers. Can I just tell you, it's a little terrifying, the music that's playing when you go into her house with this narrative that I've created. Ow! But also, what do you think happened to the original Goofy? Oh my god. Okay, first of all, that is an animatronic. I said the original Goofy. Oh, the OG black and white one. Oh, I no, baked just, him into just... a pie, sweetie. Yeah. Oh. Don't you want some dog pie? No. You look a little bit stressed out. How would you have a bit of Goofy inside of you? No! 
No! No! No! No! Cease! Desist! Stop! No! Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, Aqua. Idea, but you can't go. You can't go around looking like skin and bones. No, no, no. That's it. That's it. That's it. Someone get the gag. <laughs> yeah. I will yeah, put those, you in jail. And and a lot of them. Have, have... That's my fetish. Uh, a lot of them now have like a motorized thing where you can move them when you're up in them, but back in lot, the day. The cheaper ones and some of the older ones don't have that. You have to go all the way down and get out and push it. And yeah, no, this guy's crazy. Stare into the undead eyes of this creature. Wait, who the fuck's Goofy Jr.? Mike. Max. Max. No, well, I don't know who Goofy Jr. is. Max and Goofy Jr. I don't want to think about goofy fucking. Okay, listen, I, I've had some pretty fucked up dreams lately. I've dealt with a hurricane. I don't want to deal with the idea of goofy fucking right now. <laughs> Forever. She's a ginger? Who is? What? Goofy Jr. is a ginger! Congratulations, ginger! You now have representation! Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> I can hear the ginger's anger as we speak. Wait, and he would be older than Max. Yeah, but he got kind of got forgotten. Did Ma he grow up? It was was Goofy maybe not the best parrot initially? He grew up and then he no doesn't talk to him anymore? Or did he die of mysterious circumstances? He died when the Heartless attacked! Nerd! Uh, I was gonna point out there. Wait, wasn't he? Oh, Goofy doesn't fuck. <laughs> Goofy <laughs> Hayux. That's why they're down here. Also, apparently, hello, Zero Theron. Welcome, welcome. Also, uh, Pete's wife was also a gin. <gasps> yeah, Peg. Peg is also a dog. Goofy's a dog. Goofy and Jr. Goofy's, Goofy's wife died of mysterious circumstances. <laughs> Or at least questionable, it. or at least car canceritis. <laughs> yeah, mysterious dead pants, dead Disney parent it's disease. That's that's what she said. <laughs> There's always a, yep. Are you a Disney prince or princess? Don't worry, you only have one parent. It's to induce trauma and character development, mostly trauma. I wonder if they'll ever have that, like, fourth wall break of a Disney princess being like, You son of a bitch! You killed my parents! No, that's gonna happen in an anime. Do first. you have any idea how little that narrows it down? The best part about it would be... You know, you have that scene from Wreck-It Ralph where all the princes are all together. Yeah. And one of them was pointing out... But I can't help... And one was pointing out that uh, I can't help it. I have two... I have two fully, uh... I have two parents fully alive and capable of helping me. Well, now we live dangerously while I still can. Of being parents, and it's for most of my life. Then one, one of the strains here. I can't believe you have you have two parents. I only have the one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then there's one person going. You guys have parents? Because <laughs> the orphan. So apparently, Goofy Jr., also known as George Goof, is the original canon son of Disney's Goofy before he was redesigned into Max. Oh, so it's the same uh, kid. But here's the craziest part. There's a crazy because part? Because his mother is a normal human woman. Junior has more human features than Goofy. I didn't know there were humans in that in their world. <laughs> He oh, has yeah! orange thick, hair, thick black eyebrows, no visible ears, and a pink nose. When a teenager, he slightly mirror, mirrors Max Goof's design. Or Max Goof's design. Okay, I'd like... I'm going to ask the obvious question. The obvious question is, uh, th that just raises further questions. No, okay, to think about it, because there's a thing that a lot of people think of. The Goofy movie is really about, like, how Max is, like, a kid of mixed race. And, you know, his dad's white and his mom was black. And, you know, that kind of metaphor, a lot of people saw that. Of, you know, a kid, uh, yeah, yeah, okay, I'll shut up now. 
I, I didn't see it that <laughs> that way. I, I didn't. I know you didn't see it that way, but some I people. I've not heard. I've not heard this, but continue. So continue. Yeah. So like the goofy story is basically a white dad trying to connect with his son who is a more in touch with his personal color heritage, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Real quick, real Aqua, quick, awkward, awkward, the... somebody was a serious dog lover. <laughs> Aqua, get the fuck out. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, that's it. Aqua, prison. Gay prison. <laughs> to furry jail with you. Anyway, continue. So yeah, that's kind of like the thing. At least that's what some people on Twitter. Yay! That's what some people on uh, TikTok thought of, thought at least. Mind you, I'm on part of the good. I'm on. I would well, before I quit uh, TikTok cold turkey because I'm just like. Um, Bailiff tases. Tases their balls. <laughs> anyway, back to send. Back to trying to do the plot. 